I don't have a positive ID yet, but I think we may be looking at Mr. Floyd Collister, also known as Marcel, the grand dame of the Las Vegas female impersonators. You a fan? Mrs. Doubtfire is more my taste. The smell of booze is pretty strong. Well, I imagine Floyd's probably in his mid to late 70s, so if he tied one on last night, accidents will happen, along with maybe a stroke or a heart attack. Yeah, you're right. I mean, you might really be right about tying one on. See her... his wrists? Looks like ligature marks. Someone wanted to make sure their drinking buddy didn't leave too soon. Didn't leave until he was dead. She, you mean, until she was dead. I'm just saying. Hey, good to see you. I can always depend on the kindness and assistance of my fellow CSIs. I just got started. You're welcome to jump in on the scene with me. Or, you can talk to our one and only witness over there. You mean how she died? Well, at first blush, it's tough to say. Could be natural causes, but the special cirques are those ligature marks on the wrists and ankles. We'll know more once we get her over to Doc Robbins. Doesn't look like it. There's cash in the register, and nothing really stands out as being out of place or missing. It's been around a pretty long time. I remember I almost had my bachelorette party here. Not that my bachelorette party was that long ago, but... Anyway. After you. Our victim has tentatively been identified as Floyd Collister, but apparently he's better known as Marcel. Brass says he's known to be one of the best female impersonators in Las Vegas. I believe the term he used was Grand Dame. Someone's gotten into the whiskey. Nice work. Leaves no doubt about whose club this is. Hello, sir. We're with the Las Vegas Crime Lab. Can we get your name? Sure. Name's Gary Beaumont. I've been pretty much a regular here for, gosh, 30 years, give or take, right? Everybody knows me. I even have my own chair over there. That's mine. Nobody else gets to sit there but my butt. I found her, yes. I showed up about 9 o'clock for Bloody Mary Sundays. That's what Marcel calls it. And I I'm walking in and passing right by the stage and... And that's when I saw her, face down. I got up there, and I tried to wake her up, but she wasn't breathing, and I couldn't save her. I, I don't have any kind of training. I, I, I used to know CPR, but, you know, I, I, I just called 911. That's all I thought I could really do. Besides Mr. Collister, that is. Mr. Collister? I'm sorry, don't you mean Marcel? Yes, yeah, sorry. It's a bit confusing. Marcel. I, I didn't mean to jump on you. It's just that Marcel was truly a lady. The most kind, gracious, generous, loving, feminine spirit I've ever known. As for Floyd Collister, that person's dead to me. Well, she did own a bar. I mean, I suppose you don't have to drink to own a bar, but, but Marcel did drink and own a bar both she also smoked like a chimney well if a chimney smoked a pack and a half of Nat Sherman's a day anyway misapprehension scolded her about it all the time 
I'm sorry. I wasn't quite clear whether Marcel was having some misapprehension about her health or there's actually a person named Misapprehension? Oh no, she's not a person. She's a diva. The divine Miss A. She's been performing at the club for, well, for as long as I've been here. But you probably never heard of her, because Marcel only let one star shine here. Hers. Do you know Miss Apprehension's real name? You probably want me to say her real name is Wallace Biganowski, but she'll always be Miss A to me. Would you say they got along? Oh, no. No, no. Oil and water. Cats and dogs. Betty Davis and Joan Crawford. I mean, those two fought constantly. But they needed each other. Marcel was the star around here, but she was just awful with money. Miss A kept this place in business. Do things ever get violent between the two of them? No, never. They yelled a lot, but I think they really loved each other. Oh, no. Poor Miss A. She'll be devastated when she finds out. I should probably try to find her in case she needs a shoulder to cry on. Let me think. No, that's really all that stands out to me. If I remember something, can I call you? Do you have a card? You don't think they'll close the club down, do you? Enough booze for any occasion. Tempted, but no. Looks like Marcel forgot to take her pills. The mic's off. You can smell the alcohol, right? BAC might have contributed to the death. I'll have Doc Robbins send someone down and pick up the body. Whoa, so that's what Marcel looks like in the morning before she puts on her face. She's been a fixture in this town for as long as I can remember, but I don't think anyone's seen her like this, at least not in public. We pulled her, well, Floyd Collister's DMV records. He was born in 1938, which means Marcel is 71 years old, but she looks much younger, don't you think? Well, what time taketh away, cosmetic surgery giveth back, to some degree anyway. I'll check her medical records for the precise number of procedures. Okay. You know, I hate to be a stickler for detail about this, but we haven't really positively identified this victim. We didn't recover any form of identification on the body or at the scene. So before we go any further, let's just make sure this is Marcel or Floyd Collister or whoever or whatever. All right? 